Prince Harry has been urged to abandon his Netflix deal by a commentator who penned him a suggested resignation letter. Journalist Dan Witten blasted the portrayal of members of the royal family in the latest series of The Crown and called on the Duke of Sussex to walk away from his and Meghan Markle's agreement, said to be worth £85 million, with the streaming giant. Mr. Wooten branded the fifth season an all-out assault on the credibility, reputation, heart and soul of the monarchy, including the late Queen, King Charles, and Princess Diana. And the royal commentator wrote an imagined resignation letter in his Mail Online column which he says Harry should send to Netflix's CEO Ted Sarandos. Mr. Wooten's letter claims the royal drama manipulates the dark final days of Diana. The royal commentator hits out at Netflix for showing the princess as trying to bring down the monarchy. Mr. Wooten also blasts the callous portrayal of King Charles and says they have got the late queen all wrong. The journalist ends his imagined letter by asking for the Netflix deal to be terminated with immediate effect, adding that the crown is causing damage to the monarchy. Harry and Meghan signed their lucrative deal with the streaming giant after quitting royal duties in 2020 for a new life in the US. The Sussexes, who are living in California, have been filming a reality show as part of the agreement. But Harry, who is sixth in line to the throne, has faced ongoing calls to ditch the deal due to controversy over the crown. The fifth series was released earlier this month and comes at the start of Charles's reign. The latest season looks at the breakdown of Charles and Diana's marriage. But it has come under fire from the likes of Dame Judi Dench and former Prime Ministers Sir John Major and Sir Tony Blair over its plot lines. There have been calls for Netflix to add a disclaimer to the beginning of episodes making clear it is a work of fiction. But Diana actress Elizabeth Debicki has insisted the show's audiences know it is clearly fictional. And Dominic West, who plays Charles, described calls for a disclaimer as quite flattering. Speaking at the world premiere of the latest series, he said, I mean the reason people think that is because The Crown obviously, more than all the other thousands of films and column inches, books and TV shows that have been made about this family, feels more authentic to people. It strikes a chord with people and I think that's because it's a great show. The Crown was due to end after the fifth series, but the show's creator and writer Peter Morgan later said it will be extended to include one more. Express.co.uk has contacted Netflix and representatives for the Duke for comment.